Hey guys, my name's Jordan and today I'm going to be showing you a basic overview of how I take care of my pets and how hard it is to do it on a daily. So already out with me is Arlo and he's one of my two bearded dragons. He's a very beautiful boy. Um, as you can see, he has a bright orange beard. He's got a really pretty back. Um, he's just a normal bearded dragon. There's nothing too special about him, but he is a rescue. So as you can see, he's missing a chunk of his tail and that's because he was caged with three other bearded dragons when he was in his old home. And all three of them are now in good homes. Arlo came with me and he's the mean one. He doesn't want to cooperate, he doesn't want to sit still, but here he is. This is Arlo. Okay, next up is my other bearded dragon, Leo. Here he is. He's a big fatty. He's shedding right now, so as you can see, it's lighter right here. He was my first lizard ever, and he just turned two recently. is my leopard gecko Piper when we got her she didn't have a tail and she was very very dehydrated but now she's doing really good she is very healthy she's nice and big now she's a very sweet very very photogenic lizard I'll insert some of her pictures but she's just a very very beautiful lizard Okay, my next lizard is my Cuban Knight and El Diablo, and he just doesn't want to come out today, which isn't abnormal. He's a pretty shy lizard, but there he is back there. And we got him from a pet store that grouped him together with four other Cuban Knight and Ols, and he was just not taken care of very well. And if he was out, I could show you, but he has a huge scar on his tail. He's missing a few toes and he's got scars all up and down his body, but he's doing really good and he's getting a lot better since he came home. So my next two pets are my dogs. So this is Ellie. She's my 14 year old Yorkie Rat Terrier. And she can't hear what I'm saying at all because she's deaf. She's going blind, but she's still really, really healthy and a really, really good girl. She's really dumb. She doesn't play fetch or anything. She doesn't know any tricks, but she's really cute. So it's acceptable. This is Pearl, my Maltese poodle. And for some reason she's being camera shy right now. But here she is, and <laughs> she's probably the sweetest puppy in the world. Um, she's a big cuddle bug. She loves attention. But we got her from my aunt, who breeds dogs, or who used to breed dogs. And she was the little cutest one of the bundle, so we got her. Okay, so last but not least, I have my cat. <laughs> this is Nutella. He is huge. It's a very, very big boy. We got him from the New Beginnings Animal Rescue, and he used to be very, very small, and now he's very, very big. But he's probably the sweetest cat in the world. Um, he loves pretty much anyone. He likes to come up and cuddle with everyone. He purrs all the time, which honestly gets annoying sometimes. But yeah, that's my cat. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, make sure to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe. Subscribe.